Hey, hey, traveler. Long time no see. You been keeping well? Oh, <laughs> so you've completely forgotten who I am, huh? Really high spirits the whole way back. He kept trying to get everyone to join him for... Twilight Melody from the Solitary Zither. Hey, hey, Kaidahara kid! So, what are you up to here? We you made it. Good to see you again. This appellation, Kaidahara kid, when uttered by Paimon, it takes on a whole new tone. <laughs> the events of Inazuma are behind me, and no longer linger on my mind. That's not requiring assistance. There's nothing to get Unfortunately, you are too late for that because now there is. Huh? What's there to be guessing? There was nothing to get but somehow now there still is. What? Listen. What do you think? Wow. Well, Paimon thinks you play just like another bard we know. Who plays for loose change? Oh? You're friends with a professional bard? I hope I have the chance to meet them someday. Traveler, what do you think? Very good. You're right. More to the point, however, it has a certain special ability. I acquired this anonymous ancient zither from an abandoned cave dwelling as I was exploring the mountains. When I first found it, it was old, but intact. The sight of it inspired me, and suddenly I found myself strumming. To my surprise, as soon as the melody began, my mind began to drift. And I could hear the sound of someone playing along with me. Somehow, it all felt so familiar. Uh, just to circle back for a second, are you sure you haven't been eating anything suspicious that makes you see things that aren't there? I don't believe so. Because when the melody ended... My mind became completely clear again. That's when I finally started to inspect my surroundings properly. As expected, it was a place full of mystery. The cave was overrun with weeds, so I imagine the owner left a long time ago. But the table and chair were spotless and gave off a fine and delicate... Even the ever-present sound of the wind fell silent in that place. It was quite miraculous. <laughs> Who can say? Regardless, it was a wondrous experience. And after it was over, I, I thought to myself, I simply must share this with a friend. I doubt this would interest Beto in the least. So I decided to invite you to share this experience. Oh, so even Adeptite treasures break in the end? If eternity lies out of reach, even for the mighty Electro Archon herself, then it is all the more elusive for everything else. Be super duper careful with their Serena teapot. Luckily, in this case, the breakage is fixable. It's more akin to hibernation than anything else. The energy within the instrument has dissipated with the passage of time. <laughs> 